Now next question is what is the number of photons of light with a wavelength of 4000 picometer that provide 1 joule of energy. So what are we supposed to calculate? We need to calculate number of photons when there is a light of wavelength of 4000 picometer which can provide 1 joule of energy. So we know energy here is 1 joule uh, for wavelength 4000 picometer. We need to calculate number of photons. So here when we say energy of energy of one photon is equal to h nu which is the formula right so here from this formula we have what is Planck's constant it is a constant but we don't have frequency so what we are going to do is we are going to expand the formula so here we get E is equal to H C by lambda. So you alter the formula in such a way you can use what the lambda value given to us is. Now lambda value given to us is in terms of picometer, 4000 picometer. But we need it in terms of meters. So the conversion here is 1 picometer is equal to 10 to the power minus 12 meters. So here lambda will now become 4000 into 10 to the power minus 12 meter. C is a constant where C is equal to 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second. H value is 6.626 into 10 to the power minus 34 joule second which is the Planck's constant. So we know all values directly put it in the formula here. So that will be h is 6.626 into 10 to the power minus 34 joule second into c value is 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second divided by lambda value is 4000 into 10 to the power minus 12 meter. So we have done the substitution to this formula. Now meter and meter will get cancelled, seconds inverse and seconds will get cancelled. When we simplify this 6.626 into 3 divided by 4000 will give 0 0.004969 into minus 34 plus 8 minus 12 go up it will become plus 12. This will become 10 to the power minus 14 joule. Now when we shift the decimal this number will become bigger. So this will be 15, 16 and 17. So this will be 4.969 into 10 to the power minus 17 joule. So we know this is the energy provided by one photon. So we can write here therefore 4.969 into 10 to the power 17 minus 17 joule energy is provided by one photon. This is what is provided by one photon. Therefore, one joule of energy is going to be provided by how many photons? So one joule energy is provided by do the unitary method. So this will be here one photon into one joule divided by this value 4.969 into 10 to the power minus 17 joules. Joule and joule will get cancelled. 1 by 4.969 will give 0 0.20124 into 10 to the power minus 17 will become plus 17 here. Now this itself when we shift it to the right this will become 2.0124 into 10 to the power 16 photons. So this is going to be the number of photons required to provide 1 joule of energy. So first what we did, 
is we first calculated what is the energy of one photon. Then using that value we used a unitary method to find out for one joule of energy how much of photon is used.